like five or six days. Oh, so nice. everything comes from like the same well of time is mm -hmm. what I uh, call it. Makes sense. So even if it doesn't look like it connects, it still does. No idea. Oh, this looks pretty. Oh, you know what? I think I'll just leave it like that. Mm -hmm. Let's see what happens. I mean, look at all this stuff that I found. Yeah. I was like a blue jay caught by it. <laughs> <laughs> I should do Moody Pond garbage art. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Reeks. <laughs> so you'll start off with yellow. And this is like an absolutely beautiful brayer. Just the feel, the feel of the yeah, waves, etc. Yeah, that's a nice one. And I just typically run it down once, and we'll be sharing brayers, okay? So just, and typically start with the light, you'll have more, um, oh, look, it's got a 25 in it. Yeah, see, look at that, didn't even see that before, see, it's the, oh, and, that, and so I can use the other side as well, I didn't even realize I was doing that. And so, these rollers are pretty smooth, the ink fairly evenly goes across. This does not. As you can see, it's just, it's warped. Mm -hmm. the, right. The warpness enters a variation right. into your images. So, right. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then just for, if you want, detail. yeah, you can just kind of do something like that. And then what you do, these little things that I just gave you, is you take your paper, so you're always checking your hands. Oh, and you know what? We need to put scotch tape um, under your piece. And you clear out everything except the tape, except the, the plate. You know, just to give yourself room, because mm -hmm. it's unbelievable how much this paint will just wander. Mm -hmm. So then you can take this. There's a rough side and a smooth side. Ah. Clever. Okay, huh? and you'll feel the difference. And I like using the smooth. I think the colors show up a little bit brighter. And you just lay it on. So the smooth side is going to. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. But but you know you're welcome to use the other. I just I think the inks are a little bit brighter on the. Love the 25. Yeah. Well, some of my earlier works, I really loved having the that right in there. And the heat of your hand mm -hmm. is actually heating the ink and helping it bond to the paper. Mm -hmm. Okay, because we're not going, we're not using a press here. We're using right. either this hand mm -hmm. or this. Mm -hmm. And so you just, you know, you take your time, you go into each of the corners. But you can just do it with your hand. And it's very, you know, it's pretty sensuous to do this. Mm -hmm. And it just feels really, really nice. Oh, <laughs> I did that. <laughs> okay, oh, wow. so there's... Oh, wow, that's great. Cool. And that's see, really there was great. very little done to the piece, okay, because the three wow. colors... Single and rolls, that's what amazes me. You just did. Yeah, yes, one and pass. one roll, one pass can also, like, you don't need to roll over and over again. Uh huh. Yeah. I mean, I guess that's, this kind of one is fun because you can do that because then you'll see the, uh, you know, the outline of it. Uh huh. But the other ones, you don't see the edges. Mm -hmm. So, anyway, there's. Um, so, start, remember, start with the yellow, work to the dark. It just, um, you know more bright it. colors, more bright colors will come through. And mm -hmm. please feel free to vary. I mean, you have like 12, 13 pieces of paper to play with. Scotch yeah, scotch tape. And you know. Awesome. Yeah, and look at your little creator there, David. She's cranking away. That your wall? Paint. Huh. Oh. What was it? Used to get a bed.